Hello everyone! I finished another object, which is a shawl. Tamdu shawl. It's humongous! This is a paper pattern, I will leave links down below, so check it out. My project link, you will have that. I received this pattern as a gift from Vicky. Hi Vicky from the Sweet Leaves podcast, so check it out. She finished her way earlier than me. Uh, yeah, so it took me a while. I started on the 24th of November and we have March. First of all, I wasn't aware that I will have to cut yarn. It's so beautiful. I, it was breaking my heart. Basically, you start from this section and just build it up. So we had loads of ends and you can probably see them. You see, I don't, I didn't do a great job over here. See them, am I getting, I think I'm getting better here. You see the back of it now, so. Uh, I'm getting better over here, especially in this section. I won't cut the yarn, I will just keep it with me. I was cutting it over here and once I was doing the lace pattern I was going back and so on and so on so that kind of gave me a nice breather and went back to the swing with it and then I figured out I was doing something wrong. I wasn't getting a beautiful effect like it's over here. Hopefully you can see it. That uh, knit stitch is running without any problems, any bars or anything like that but if I show you over here you can see bars. So that's my special touches and I love this bind off. It did not take me long and I adore it. I move slightly so you can see those bumps. I had to frog it. In this section I miscounted and I had a bit of adventure and you can see photos over here because I love to share my knitting adventures with you and how to wear it. I haven't even put it yet. I washed it and blocked it that way because it's just too long for me. It's lovely, isn't it? And the yarn, guys, I can't wait to tell you about yarn. And I have leftovers, yes. So I'm going to have a hat, yes. Anyway, I'm wearing a hat because my hair are a disaster, so let's keep this. I'll leave a link to this hat, how I make it. Anyway, let's tell you what tools I used. I used this amazing bag by Diane. You can find a link to her shop in my project page. And I love it is Two in one. I can show you this one day, and I can show you this another day. <laughs> Both beautiful, I love purple. And those lovely flowers, they are the best. I used some stitch markers that I received from Vicky. Um, I used 3.25 millimeters needles. The pattern comes for 3.5, but I'm a loose knitter. I think I'm a loose knitter. So I wanted to kind of skip in and I received these uh, from a viewer again. Thank you so much. They're like a second hand, so I'm recycling stuff and I'm, I love using them. They're not so uh, sharp. So during the lace, I now I understand why you have, why you need sharp needles, especially when you're working with the lace. But you know, at the end of the day, I don't have any issues with it. The pattern looks like this. Um, in regards to the pattern, what I can say, it was a little bit fiddly for me to understand what color is what because the pattern calls you for light, medium and dark. But it doesn't say like that, it just says A, B, C and when you check the pattern, it says starts with B. <laughs> and, you know, smart me, I printed it in black and white and I don't know which one is which one. <laughs> because you have three, right? So the owner of this amazing shop got in touch with me, helped me by Instagram, amazing Instagram, Seawall Fibers, and she explained that to me how it works. And what do you think now? It's amazing, isn't it? Because she wasn't sure about it variegated because they were so close together. I call them three sisters, but they're not. And this is light, this is variegated, so I presume medium, and this is dark. I love these. I want these, by the way, in the giveaway on Instagram, guys. So play. I sometimes put in giveaways over there. I draw someone today, so I'm so happy about it. I hope you're too better. Uh, yeah, and I go hope that you're going to get your one soon. Yeah, I think that's all. Anything else? It was a long knit. Uh, the final project, I'm delighted with it. I'm not going to give it to anyone. I'm going to keep it because look at this. It's amazing. I love it. All the knitters were just flying through it and I was like, what the heck? I don't understand. <laughs> but once you know ABC, what's that? Um, you know the system that please read um, first page. This is page one. So you have to read first page three, then you're reading page two and you have the rest on uh, the page four and you're just going back and forth from the page two to four. So that was a little bit for me, you know, but probably that's okay. And uh, yeah, and on the back, I can show that, yeah. On the back you have all the information 
uh, what kind of stitches you will need to use, what kind of materials you need to use. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for the pattern, Vicky. Thank you for giveaway and uh, yeah, I'm thrilled about it. I hope you enjoyed this one. Go on Instagram, use hashtag with I love to show me what you're knitting, anything with anything. And I hope to see you next time. Bye.